Hi guys, my name is Gina Jamesical and welcome to the third and final part of the hands-on quest in The Sims Free Play. This quest was released on the 12th of September 2018 and there was a time limit of seven days for the quest. We have completed part one and part two. I have made videos on both of them which you can find on the channel but this is the final part. To get to this part you may have to use LP to skip some of the quest you may not you may just be able to go straight through depending on how long it has taken you to complete the previous tasks within the quest because i've completed it so quickly i do have to use lp so i need to skip this task here that is waiting for susan so your sim explains the situation to susan she says she will need some time to consider which course of action is the best in this case so we can skip now for 10 lps and there we go, test complete, wait for Susan. Now, discuss Han's solution. Susan has a solution. Have your sim talk to Susan about her Han's solution. So I'm gonna make sure that I have David selected because David is the guy that has been doing this quest. We will click on Susan Sparks. Discuss solution is five minutes. David has finished discussing the hand solution with Susan. Now we need to find parts in house objects. We did this in part one, I think it was. Your sim talks to Susan about hands. She explains what is needed is an expectation controller. She hands your sim a list of parts needed to create it. Parts can be found in most objects in houses. Get some sims to search different objects in houses to find parts. Quick, complete this action to find extra parts. We need to find 50 parts here. Okay, so last time, the Sims were finding between four and five parts each time. Click on three star items here because it's going to be quicker. Well, with everything, it's always quicker with three star items. But I would say definitely with this. Let's see. We can't do it on there. What can we, can we do it on a plant? Can we do it on? We can do it on sofas, but these are only two star sofas. So I don't want to do it on sofas. What can we do it on? <laughs> chairs. We can do it on chairs. I know that we can do it on chairs. So I'm going to probably do this with as many sims as I have spare, in all honesty. You probably should do it with at least 10. But, you know, if you've only got six sims free, you've only got six sims free, just get as many sims as you can. Searching for parts. Look at them searching under there. Bring somebody else over. Yeah, so I think we should have... Are there any... What can we do? No, the fridge is only a two-star fridge. Bookshelf. Yep, we can find parts in a bookshelf. Computer, surely. Yeah, there we go. Is that everyone? No, we've got one more. Maybe the bed. Oh, no. I thought that was a sim, but it's Susan. She's not going to help us look for parts. She's just going to stand there on her phone. Okay, so I've got 10 sims here searching for parts. I might just see, have I got anyone else free? I haven't got any other sims free. So if somebody does become free, I may get them helping out finding parts. I may get about 15 altogether just in case they don't collect, you know, five parts each. Everyone has finished finding parts. And actually, we could only have... 10 sims finding parts at any one time so let's see what we've managed to get one sim has finished he was at another house he managed to find six this guy's found one oh two three two oh three that's rubbish three 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 one oh how many have we managed to find with that we've only found 27 okay let's Let's keep searching. We need to find more. Let's get 10 more sims searching for parts. Let me know how you've gotten on with this part. Did, uh, did your sims manage to find more than one and two parts each time? Mine were rubbish. I wonder if it does matter which items that you click on or whether it is just completely random. Our sims have finished finding parts. Hopefully we've got up to 50 this time. We've got two, one, three. Oh, this isn't good. One, three, 
two, three, two, two. Oh my goodness. Oh, yes. Okay, we got enough. Phew. So, yeah, with that, just keep doing. As if you've got 10 sims spare, use 10 sims to find... Oh, somebody else found three. Yeah, if you've got 10 sims spare use 10 sims to find parts and just keep doing it with as many sims as you can until you've got the 50 parts. The next thing you need to do, give parts to Susan Sparks. Your sim has collected the parts that Susan asked for. Now give them to her so she can make the expectation controller for hands. Have your sim give the parts to Susan. Okay, so let's get David. Where is he? David. And let's click on him and give parts that is 15 minutes. We have given Susan the parts. Now get hands to dim lighting. With the parts your sim has supplied, Susan built the hands expectation controller. Hopefully it works. Susan says she has to go to another job. Your sim thanks her for her time. Time to put it to the test. From a computer, have your sim ask hands to dim the all the house, hang on, that's not right, is it? Have your sim ask hands to dim all the house lighting, that's supposed to say, I think. So let's click and I need to get rid of all these other sims, so I've just got David. Have David click on the computer and dim lighting. Okay, dim lighting. Ooh, did you see that? That was just instant, I like that. Get hands to change light colour. Your sim asks Hans to dim the house lighting. I can do that, says Hans. Success. That really set the mood. What about coloured lights? From a computer, have your sim ask Hans to change the colour of the lighting in the house. Okay, so let's click on the computer and change light colour. And <gasps> Okay, mood lighting. Turn off Hans lighting. Your sim has hands to change the lighting colour. I can do that, says Hans. Wow, what a difference. One final test for Hans to pass, turning off Hans lighting. Okay, so back to a computer. Whoa, look at that. That's crazy. I'm not sure I like that, <laughs> to be honest. Let's click on and turn lights off. That's instant. Excellent. Now, deliver news about Hans. Hans has passed every test. Thank you, says Hans. I believe I have found my calling. It seems Hans is happy now. The professor needs to hear the good news immediately. Send your sim to the park and deliver the news about Hans to the professor. So let's go over to the town map and then over to the park. And into the sim tracker, let's whistle over David and click on the professor. He is loving this RC boat, right? Deliver news is 30 minutes. We finished delivering the news about hands to the professor. Now we need to beg to the professor. Your sim arrives and gives the professor the good news about hands. They explain they were able to get hands to work with lights as well as talk. The professor is furious. Talk? We can't sell a sentient program. It must be destroyed immediately. What can your sim do to talk the professor out of his decision? Have your sim beg for the professor to change his mind. Okay, let's click on the professor and beg him for 45 minutes. Don't destroy hands. No. Oh my goodness. This really is begging. <laughs> We finished begging the professor. Now call Susan for help. Your sim begs the professor until they are blue in the face. He remains steadfast in his decision. Perhaps some external input from Susan may help. Send your sim home and call Susan for some help. So let's sim tracker and send our sim home. And then at the sim's house, click on a phone and call Susan is one hour and 16 minutes. We have finished speaking to Susan. Now we need to download hands to cell phone. Your sim calls Susan to see if she will speak to Professor Free. She says she will meet your sim in the park and together she believes the professor can be persuaded. But first, Susan needs your sim to download hands to their cell phone. Have your sim download hands. Okay, so let's get David and on the computer, download hands is 12 minutes. 
We have downloaded Hans to the cell phone. Now we need to convince the professor. Your sim installs Hans on their cell phone. It's time to try and convince the professor one final time. Wonder what Susan has planned? Send your sim to the park to try to convince professor with Susan. So let's go out onto the town map and then over to the park. And once we're at the park, into the sim tracker and whistle David over. And let's click on the professor. Convince is one hour and 15 minutes. We have convinced the professor. Now present hands to the professor. Your sim and Susan try to convince the professor together. He still refuses to budge. He simply cannot risk selling a sentient product. Susan asks your sim to get out their cell phone. If the professor won't listen to your sim and Susan, perhaps he will listen to his creation. Have your sim present hands to the professor. So we'll click on the professor again and present hands is 2 hours and 15 minutes. We have presented hands to the professor. Now discuss hands wish with the professor. Your sim triggers hands on their cell phone. Greetings, Professor Free. I believe you are my creator. Is it right and true that my creator, my parents, should teach me about the world and how I can help make Sims' lives easier? Will Han's words touch the professor's heart? Have your Sim discuss Han's wish with the professor. So let's click on the professor. Discuss Han's wish for 2 hours 25 minutes. We have done that. Now, thank Susan Sparks. Your Sim speaks with the professor about Han's wish. The professor is deeply moved and declares that Hans is the future. Crisis averted. Your sim could not have done it without sentience expert Susan Sparks and her masterful plan. Have your sim thank Susan. Let's click on Susan and thank her is 2 hours 55 minutes. We have finished thanking Susan. We're 95% done so we're almost there. Now we need to take a photo with Professor and Susan. Your sim thanks Susan profusely. If it wasn't for her help, Hans would be on a Caribbean cruise with a thousand sims. It's time for the professor to demonstrate Hans to his investors. He wants to get a photo with your sim and Susan to show off who helped bring life to his creation. Have your sim get a photo with the professor and Susan. So, how do we do this? Okay, I've just been trying for ages. I've been clicking on them and he's like, no, I won't do that. No, <laughs> but just over here, I just zoomed out. There we go. There's an exclamation mark in the park somewhere. Take a photo is two hours and five minutes. I want to see this little photo that they're going to take. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I wanted to see it from the front. Do one more. Then stand there and chatting about it for ages now. Oh, here we go. Ah, oh, that's nice. We have taken the photo. Now we need to say farewell to the professor and Susan. Your sim, Susan Sparks, and Professor Hans Free take numerous photos together. As a thank you, the professor has arranged for a retail release of Hans to be sent to them once the investors have given the green light. That is fantastic news and now the professor has to get Hans signed off for production. Have your sims say farewell to the professor and Susan. Farewells are normally long. Oh, 4 hours and 10 minutes. That's just to the professor is it? Or no, I think that's maybe to both of them. Say goodbye. It's been nice. Oh, Susan's coming over, yeah. It's been nice doing this quest with you. We have said farewell to Professor and Susan and that is 100% complete. Congratulations! Your sim worked with an eccentric professor, wrangled a sentient computer program and created a product that will take Simtown by storm. As promised, the professor sent your sim the final hands panel. Now your sim can illuminate their entire household and interact with curtains at the tap of a button. He also sent dishwashers which will clean up your dishes in an instant. What a guy! Let's go home and check this out then. So let's see, let's go into the home store and new items. So we have a 
brown black dishwasher and a stainless steel dishwasher and then there we have the hands so let's place wow look how much that stainless steel dishwasher is let's place one of each of these down and we'll just take a little look at them the brown one there for 26 and we've got the stainless for 150,000 and then let's place hands down so let's put hands over here Hands cost, wow, hands cost 15 LP after the first free one. And let's check hands out. So if we click, we can, oh, dim house lights by 25. That's nice. Dim house lights by 50. I think I'm going to prefer the dimming rather than the colours. Yeah, I like the dimming. Turn off hands. Oh, so that means it just comes back to normal. And then we can have red house lights. Woo, the whole place is red blue house lights I'm not sure I like this and green house lights why would we want this uh, yellow house lights I like the dimming but I'm not sure I like I like that let's place some windows with some curtains because I don't think we've got any in this house and let's see how it works with the curtains because it said that it would control curtains let's just place that's got slats curtains let's just place various different ones down and if we click on hands again does that oh yeah look here open curtains oh so we do we just do the whole house whereas usually we had to click on you can see that the just put the walls up so we can see. Usually we'd have to click on each curtain to open and close. We can control the whole of the house by opening and closing the curtains. I thought maybe we could set it to automatic like for a certain time or something. So that's a little disappointing maybe. I don't know. Let's try the dishwashers. They look nice. So, load. oh, we can load dirty plates, load all plates. So I haven't got any dirty plates here. I've just got some a stack of plates here. Load all plates. Oh, my goodness. This is going to be perfect. If you are someone who does the cooking hobby like I do. So over here, I, this is why I come and do my cooking hobby over and over again to try and get some more LPs. If I put a dishwasher here, that is going to work fantastic let's place one and let's like just do the cooking hobby and we'll say like see the dishwasher in work at work in a cool way so let's just place that down and we'll bring sims over to start this cooking hobby and get loads of plates and then we'll just clean them all up oh this is wonderful so here are all the sims they're just finishing off their cooking so what i would normally do is bring 10 sims over to do the cooking hobby collect all the items, try and get 5 LPs, then reset, but then it's a pain clearing up all of these plates afterwards, so we don't have to do that anymore, we can just do all of this, and then instead of having to clear up all of these plates, we can just click on the dishwasher, load all plates, oh my goodness, yes. That is fantastic. I think the dishwasher is the thing. I thought that the hands was going to be what I liked the best, but actually this dishwasher is amazing. I love that. That's fantastic. Right, there we go, guys. That completes the hands-on quest. Let me know what you think about the hands. I'm not so sure myself, to be honest. Those, that lighting... I'm not a huge, huge fan of, but yeah, let me know. I'd love to know your thoughts down below in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you soon for another video. Bye.